Hello everyone, I am Khalid from Building Point Australia and in this video I want to show you how you can work with the weld in a right way. So I got this uh, model from actually you know, one of the um, Ideasetica users and uh, the question is about this uh, weld, placing the weld in the right manner. So as you can see in this connection, we have, which is here, I have the gasset plate and here this angle is connecting to this gasset plate. And uh, for placing the weld, so here the gasset plate operation is used and here you have the weld. And uh, if I just deactivate the weld from here, so here you can see that the angle is here. And once I come back to this weld so I can actually now see it in this way in this way so the first the first problem with this weld is about the direction of the weld which is not correct I can change it to something like this right now is okay so definitely I can play with the uh, weld size but uh, the issue is that here so there is no any weld at this edge of the angle so what we can do with this issue so another way that uh, I can do it so simply I will say that okay so I don't want to have the weld here even in gasset plate operation and then I will go to add another weld which is here I simply use the weld operation as you can see here you can go to operation and here you have the weld or contact operation so let's look at it uh, if I come back here so again I can see that here there is another problem and uh, for assigning the weld so simply selection cursor was used and then so here make sure that you know the member is selected and then here I will say that I want to weld this member to this plate so make sure that the plate is selected and then from here I will select the or click on the selection mode and I will select the gasset plate okay and that's why here you can see that automatically the weld is assigning here but here I have the weld which is nice but the problem is that here I don't have the weld here or let's say proper weld here so what we can do with this problem so the solution is very easy so just you need to uh, come to this uh, uh, drop down menu that you have here and from here you can actually you know just uh, look for the uh, right um, let's say face of the element or angle to be welded with the gasset plate for example here if I go to member 94 button flange 1 okay so how we can understand actually you know which one is the button flange or top flange if I just uh, hover your cursor here so at the bottom left you can see the information of, about this uh, member so you can see member 94 web 1 cross section 75 star 6 and so on and so forth okay so this is actually you now the web 1 okay so that's why you need to select the web 1 instead of button flange okay so I will come to member 94 web 1 just click on that and then so from here so the thing that you need to do so here I can go to transparent view and you have the edges okay edge number one which is here edge number two which is here and edge number three which is here so that's why here in one uh, let's say operation you can say that you want to weld edge number one space number two space number three to be welded with the gasset plate and then enter that's it and you can go back to solid view and from here you have it perfectly okay and uh, yeah even you can look at it in this way so here you have this welding with the angle or let's say the bottom flange of the angle or web of the angle with the gasset plate. I hope uh, this uh, uh, short uh, video and you know the tips give you some insight about how to work with the weld. 
Thank you so much. Stay tuned with us and have a great day. Bye-bye.